And we are off. This is the Sitski men's final. And once again, all skiers starting at the same time as they are all LW12 class skiers. And all Tushkov and Ilaludinov right now as they are moving away from the group. And what about, oh no, going down is Ramil Ilaludinov at a very, very bad spot for him on the climb. Whoa, that could be Norwegian. Norwegian. Rigve Steinar Larsen have it in him to make it here. Here he comes to the finale, looking for a world championship. Is none other than Russia's Roman Petushkov. And look at the race here. It will be a Russian sweep with in second place, Ramil. One, two, three. Un, deux, trois ici pour les Russes aujourd'hui à Soleftio. Et il a tout donné. Dirk Steiner Larsen giving it all he had to make it to the podium, but today it is being chased down now. And uh, the new star of this event, Maria Iovaleva, is making her way to the front, attacking exactly where she did in the semifinals and passing right now, Anja Vika. Oh of a distant skier, and this one is going to be all about Maria Yovaleva of Russia, followed by Olena Yorkovska, and ending up in third today from Norway, Marianne Martinson, Anja Vicker. Right there, her victory here today. Very, very strong as let's uh, applaud Ludmila Wojcik and uh, bringing it home for Russia. Another medal here for them. Maria Yovaleva is world champion of the women's Sitski LW. And there we are. We are off with our men's standing sprint final. And once again, some toe. As they are coming around the last bend, Dolly right on the back of Lekomsev skis. Are we going to see a sprint here? Which track will be chosen by Vladislav Lekomsev or Mr. Vegard Dolly? It is a two up sprint. Here we go. Does Lekomsev have it in him? It's going to be close. Oh! It looks from our vantage point to be Vladislav Lekomsev from Russia just beating out Vegard Dali of Norway. Hard to tell and uh, seeming to be in. As we go to our replay here on the board, looking, yes, it will be definitely Vladislav Lekomsev from Russia in, a, in an epic battle in the Nordic scene. And we're just waiting for our official results. And there we are, green means go. So Yulia Bantekova is now off. Following her immediately is Alexandra Kononova from the Ukraine, Shoko Ota from Japan. Also, Maya Yarvela from Finland, Larisa Varona from Belarus. And taking off as we speak, is uh, having some difficulty on the climb. Getting some slippage here. Having to wishbone it a bit on the steepest portion. Aripa right behind her. Oh, imagine this, a world title for a Swede on home soil. The Swedes coming so close at the Nordic World Championships in Valdi Fiat. Verona now. Making it in, but it is Elena Ripa from Sweden that has taken the lead. There she is, making her way back into the stadium. Well, she will be the world champion at home. There she is, she will cross the line, and from Sweden, world champion Elena Ripa. And Larissa Varona now making her way. She will win silver here today. And bronze medalist will be Alexandra Kononova of the Ukraine. But the world champion and the story here today. Three, two, 
And there we are, the start of our women's blind visually impaired final. Who will it be? Elena Revizova, number 91. Mihalina Laisova, number 92. Yulia Budalieva, number 93. Elena Laisova coming towards the end here, making this one look easy almost, as she is in the final tracks for a world championship title in the women's blind and visually impaired class. Ladies and gentlemen, your world champion from Russia, Mialina Laisova and her guide, Alexei Ivanov. And rounding out here, the second spot, finally finishing with her guide, Natalia Yakimova, Elena Rimazova. And we will have another Russian sweep here as in third place, we will have Yulia Budalieva garnering a bronze medal today. So one, two, three, Russia in the women's blind and visually impaired sprint today in Soleftio, Sweden. will complete the start here. There goes Shatsia Boy for Belarus. And in five seconds, there go McKeever and Ponomarev. The hunt is now on. La chasse est commencé. Here we go, 1.125 kilometers. Will the Swede, Sebastian Modin, start it? As Sebastian Modin can now feel the presence and the passing of Brian McKeever. McKeever going for gold here today as he has just passed Sebastian Modin. Sebastian Modin. And I think it is still Shatsia Boy for Belarus behind, but they have lost some tracks. And there we go. World champion from Canada to Canada, the champion du monde, Brian McKeever. And in second place, silver medal from Sweden, Svarias, Sebastian Modin. And Alvin Akarut, uh, Eric Carlton joining McKeever. Congratulating Sebastian. And in third place, our troisième place, Vasily Shatsiaboy from Belarus and his guide, Mihal Lebedjou. There we go. A second medal for